Good day viewers and thank you most sincerely for tuning into Polymer Update TV, the world's first TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. You are watching the Petrochemical Market Synopsis with me, Bradley Thompson. It is Friday, January 12th. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices rose on Thursday as violence continued to intensify in the Middle East region with the Red Sea crisis showing no signs of de-escalation. Brent crude prices rose by 0.61 cents settling at $77.41 per barrel while WTI futures increased by 0.65 cents settling at $72.02 per barrel. On Thursday, open spec naphtha prices fell by $2 per metric ton at $664 per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. This week, HDP export prices witnessed a sharp rise in the United States. Reports of persistently tight product availability for prompt export cargoes supported the price rise. HDP injection molding prices were assessed at the $860 to $880 per metric ton FAS Houston levels, a steep week-on-week -week rise of $65 per metric ton. HDP BM export prices were assessed at the $915 to $935 per metric ton FAS Houston levels, a surge of $85 per metric ton from last week. Meanwhile, HD film export prices were assessed at the $950 to $970 per metric ton FAS Houston levels, a spike of $75 to $80 per metric ton from the previous week. This week, polypropylene spot prices climbed in Europe. This week, PVC prices were left unchanged in Europe. This week, polypropylene export prices rolled over in the United States. This week, polyvinyl chloride export prices were assessed steady in the United States. In plant news, Sinopec SK Wuhan is likely to take off stream its number two polypropylene plant for maintenance in mid January 2024. The plant is slated to remain shut until end January 2024. Located in China, the plant has a production capacity of 200,000 metric ton per year. That's all for today's polymer news. Watch our daily news video on Monday to know more. This is Polymer Update, with me Bradley Thompson, from Polymer Update's Virtual World. Many thanks for watching.